One local group in Minneapolis was in the kitchen before sunrise cooking up a hot meal for those in need. But Kaya Edwards tells us what they do goes beyond the holiday. Happy Thanksgiving. We are at one of the centers for Salvation Army, but I want to introduce you to Richard Barr because you're not with Salvation Army, you're with 2.4 Ministries, which is a ministry of Grace Fellowship Church in Brooklyn Park. So this is a kind of a community effort here. We have over 40 volunteers that staff this breakfast. So we actually do this every single day. So we do this 365. I've watched over 10 years uh, people's lives changed just by simply having breakfast and creating relationships with people. But the unexpected thing is the impact it's had on the volunteers. And it is Thanksgiving though, so there is something slightly different today than the normal meals. So what's going on with that? Every Thanksgiving we try to do a little something special, yeah. actually assembled some personal care kits that we're providing today. So it's got soap, shampoo, toothpaste, toothbrush. We do it as an expression of our faith. I mean, we give glory to God for everything that's provided for us. And vegan restaurant Jay Selby's in St. Paul offered a Thanksgiving alternative for those in need. For the second year, they opened on Thanksgiving to serve a plant-based meal for free. Things like mashed potatoes, stuffing, cranberry sauce, and rolls. We love our community and we, you know, we like hanging out with each other. So we're, we're having a good time all around today and it helps that we can feed some people who uh, need to be fed. They also took donations for the Hiawatha Homeless Encampment. Jay Selby's is still open for another 30 minutes.